welcome to another summer tin scoop. We are here at Mama Bella Hot Sauce and Jellies, and let's go talk to Ana Bella. Follow me. My name is Ana Bella Gonzalez de Anda, and I am the owner of Mama Bella Hot Sauce. Well, um, when we, just, we started with just hot sauces, and the color was orange, and it was spicy, and, because we use habanero peppers, and I started thinking about it, I thought, well, that's my mom's favorite color, and she always carried peppers in her purse. So it was just so fitting that I would call it, I name it after her. And we give donations to Hospice of Yuma in memory of her. And my father-in-law and my dad too also. But it just all fell in place that I thought, you know what, let's name it after my mom with her red hair and, you know, and she loved peppers. So that's why we named it after my mom. So we'll see our jellies, our eight ounce jars, our two ounce jars. Uh, most of them, as you can see, have habanero. Our, they're pepper jellies. They're infused with habaneros. And over here are our hot sauces. And again, as I mentioned, they're tomatoless. They do not have any to, uh, tomato, and so that's why most of them are the color of the habanero pepper. They're orange. And some of them look like baby food, so but don't let that fool you. It's a lot of habanero, you're, and it's fresh. And we also preserve them with fresh lemons from Yuma. We pick the lemons around town, and we juice them ourselves and that is what preserves our hot sauces. So that's another unique uh, feature about our hot sauces. They are preserved with a Yuma product, the lemons, the yellow ones. We use Eureka and Lisbon lemons to, uh, to preserve them. Rocket Farms is one of them. They carry my products at their beautiful little store in Old Yuma and we have a good variety of their chocolates as you can see. So I'm very happy to have their products here at my store. And then over here, we have uh, Desert Olive. We brought some of their wonderful products where you can pair an oil and a vinegar. And they also, they gave me some suggestions on how to pair them. They are also in, uh, in downtown Old Yuma. Then Nikki's Chickies, she carries my jellies at her beautiful little store. And I brought some of her infused uh, shinies that she does. And then over here, we have some local raw honey. Uh, from a farm here in Yuma, and I changed it a little. I got some of these jars, so this is the raw, local, unfiltered, but over here, it's that honey, but I added habanero and ghost peppers to it. I infused those flavors to it. Just like Nikki's Chicky infused some flavors into her honey, I infused this. Oh, and then if I may add, there's another thing that I make and you might enjoy when you come to my little store. My, uh, they're my little apples. I dehydrate. I love to dehydrate apples. We have cinnamon apples and we also have the spicy ones over here. My hours are Fridays and Saturdays, 11 to 4. Maybe in the summer I'd like to add another day, Thursdays, when I slow down a bit because this is the busy season. I uh, These stores here have our products around town, so carry our products. So I'm always preparing product and taking it to these beautiful local shops. So I prepare them here. Well, uh, we began in Somerton. When we were thinking about starting a hot sauce company, my husband said, if you ever do, he says, could we please have it in Somerton? And uh, he says, I was raised in Somerton, I work in Somerton, and it's growing, and I, I want our company to be part of the growth in Somerton. So we did, back in 2012, we started our company here. After six years, we found another kitchen, we outgrew that one, we went to Yuma, but we were always calling uh, all around Somerton to look for another kitchen. So uh, this September, we came back home to Somerton. So don't be afraid to, um, if you have a dream, a goal, uh, just, you can do it. it. Just put all your thoughts down on the paper, uh, talk to a lot of people, whatever we can all do to help each other. Uh, it is a little uh, scary, but it can be done. Uh, everyone is out there to, 
willing to help you. It's just amazing the, the uh, support you get from family, friends. Yeah. And, yeah. You, and you know what? It's funny that you say that because every time we say what makes our little city so special mm -hmm. is exactly that, that even though we leave mm -hmm. um, to get ready for life, go to school, um, move to for better opportunities, some way or somehow we end up coming back for our beautiful summer too. Yes, yes, and that's what we did. And um, we're just excited about that. And we are very excited to have you here. Thank you. And so. we want to thank you for letting the city of Summerton in your store. And anything that the city can do to support you, please let us know. And also, we encourage anyone who wants the Summerton scoop to go to your business and promote whatever goodies you have to offer to the community, please let us know and we will see you soon. Bye. Bye.